channel first of all i'd like to apologize to you guys for not posting anything in like months after posting my proposal video even though i told you guys that i was going to carry you guys along with the planning and everything i'm sorry hmm? people not you're not vexed for your girl don't be hungry please i'm very sorry about it and i am here to tell you people i'm here to give you people one very good news the news is <laughs> for those that have been on my channel when i say the news they would really understand where i am coming from but it's not yet time for the news so yes let me welcome the new people the new ones my new ogs welcome to my youtube channel if this is your very first time coming across my channel my name is lami and i talk about everything healthy healthy conversation healthy lifestyle going to the gym eating healthy just basically having healthy living i do lifestyle vlog too i've not started lifestyle but very soon <laughs> very soon we are bringing it and yes there's this one more thing that i think i will soon start talking about on my channel which is tech now this one is a very very sensitive one because it is knowledge based so i have to get my facts right before i come on here to say anything so that is going to lead me to the main aim for today's video so in today's video i'm basically going to be giving you guys like a life update why your girl has been away for months <laughs> that's just basically what i'm doing in today's video and if you are an og thank you so much like you guys are my og for life thank you for sticking with the family i love you so much like you are here no is it you are here <laughs> this is where you are thank you so much now let's go straight into today's video like i said today's video is just basically a life update yes i'm just giving you guys an update about what your girl has been up to why i have not posted in a while and i'll be sharing one very massive good news like my mind is blown my mind is blown away i can't wait to share this news with you guys so i'm going to be starting with um my journey into thick yes that is where i want to start this update from so yes your girl has finally started a journey into thick and to god be the glory it has been an amazing journey so far and i am so excited and i can't wait to share i can't wait to share my journey with you guys like i cannot wait that's what i said when i've been introducing thick to this channel but it's not something i am so certain about yet because i don't know if it is i don't know if i'll be able to do it basically because tech is like it's something that you really need to like know it know it so you can't just come on here and tell you what you do <laughs> what you are not like really grounded at so whether we will whether we will not we'll find out later in the future in january i was able to start a course with the help of one very sweet human she placed a call and she was like why don't you do thick like if there's anything you want to put your energy into now i think you should just go into thick and i was like eh she was like yeah that tech is like where the money is tech is where the money <laughs> tech is where the money is and tech is the future and i was like okay but i was like i'm scared she was like what are you scared of and there's nothing to be scared of George. just take the course and know it that's it and you start practicing this lady went all out like she went out of her way out of her convenience out of her time she took her time and got the product management she just helped me to get somebody that did product management and that is already practicing she got me all the materials that the person used and she sent everything to me like when i say some people are even sense like they are just even sense honestly and i am so grateful to her so i took the course and yes if there is any time in your life you want to ever ever go into product management i'm going to beg you this udemy link i'm going to be leaving in my description box down below just go to that link like click <laughs> please follow that link and take that course so i took the course and you know I, I i fell in love with product management and then that was how the journey started for me 
So after taking the course, I took other courses that she sent to me. And after I took everything, she had, normally the course was like a three month course or thereabout. But I took mine in like one month because I was trying to like one first time. They always say, oh, when you start sales, so starts in January. In six month time, you would have finished. It is a lie. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let anybody deceive you about tech. See, eh? Tech is good though. Tech, there's money there. Everything is easy and like when you start making the money is sweet, but you have to put in the work. Like you will do like this because the thing that some of these tech people, some of these tech people actually study computer science in school. They did this thing for five years. You want to do it for six months and be perfect. You will stop. <laughs> you will go through it. Like you will go through it. You will feel it. Then go feel it. <laughs> You literally feel it, honestly. Let me just be very frank with you guys. So that was my mentality when I wanted to start. I was like, okay, let me take that. Was I need to be causing like fast sharp sharp sharp. That when I'm done, I'm going to take suspicion exam. Da 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 like that. Not like when I finished taking the course, even with the ones she sent, imposter syndrome came knocking. Like bang 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 bang, I'm here because I did. I, it felt like as though I didn't even know anything. And I was like, I, I was just always scared. I didn't want to practice. In fact, at the point, I didn't want to open anything related to product management because it was scaring me out. So after that, I, I after taking the other courses, I realized that, okay, I've not gotten the kind of knowledge that I need. So I was like, okay, let me see if I can take another course. But I wasn't even looking to take another course. I was like, let me see if I can get an internship role or something. So I started looking for internship. There is no internship. Oh. There is no. And the annoying thing is that these people will say, okay, we need, they can say, we need an associate product manager with five years' experience. And I'm like, well, why do you want us to see this thing? Some will even say an internship role with two years' experience. An internship, internship, I've not done it before. Like, I've not done it before. <laughs> So there was no internship was not coming forth, nothing was coming, and February had passed, March had passed, April had passed. We're going into May. And I was like, God, what is going to happen? Like we're going into half of the year and I've never achieved this particular one goal as regarding this product management thing. So I just told myself that. Maybe I should not be doing products management. Maybe I should be doing something else. I kind of have um background in project management. Number one, because of where I work. I work as a facility manager. You all know how I share the good news of that one. If you don't know, if you have not watched it, go and watch my birthday vlog and it is there. So I currently work as a facility manager. So I was like, mm, I kind of have project management knowledge why don't i just do project because this product management like it's not my it's not coming forth so in may now yeah i now started this course so i started taking the course and the course was really nice now the course did not have product management they had product owner and i was like it doesn't matter let me just get my hands on something because I, I, I was told that we're going to like work on life projects and I was like okay wow that that's even the best because getting internship wasn't coming for so that was like the easiest way for me to get something to put in my portfolio so I didn't care whether I was product management or product owner because I know the roles are not the same but they are similar kind of so I decided to take the course and I started the course in May and then it was a, it was a two months eight weeks course here yeah? so i took the course and also the very i'm currently like we have ended the course the course has ended and i am currently working on my product like i am so happy if i was told in january that i will be building a product in june i'm going to argue to the bone like i'll argue it because I didn't see myself doing like I it was something I was so scared of. But I'm so glad that I am doing this, like I'm literally doing it. I'm not yet so good, but I know that it is something that has to be time. So yeah, so that was how I was able to like take the course and get my like I was able to gain more confidence in product management. See, one thing I have learned so far this year is that if you are not going to be shy, if you are not going to be proud, you are going to go very far. Yes, you heard that right. 
are you writing down if you're not going to be shy if you're not going to be fearful if you're not going to be proud you're going to go very far because the holy spirit is already here to help you so you have to put yourself in a position where you can be helped so the holy spirit is going to give you instructions about things to do if you don't follow it sorry for you so yes that's easy <laughs> is basically the story about how i got my foot into tech and your girl has started the journey like the journey has started for me i don't know how it's going to be like some days um i want to drop off some days i want to stop some days i'll be like you know what i'm not interested again but somehow i just keep picking up myself that you have to do this you don't have a choice i'm just really grateful honestly i'm really grateful that i mean this thing is something that was looking like impossible in January or last year and now I am in it like I am literally in it I'm so grateful and I cannot wait ha I cannot wait to share the news with you guys about when I finally land my first tech job I don't know when it will be or maybe it will be this year maybe it will be next year or by year I don't know but I just know that one day one day I'll sit in front of my screen like this and I'll tell people I got a job in tech currently i'm just an intern now let's move to the next thing the second good thing that has happened the second update about my life is that i took a leadership course to um in church so i had a list of goals that i wanted to achieve in this year and one of them was my spiritual goal like i really wanted to have an intimate relationship with god i wanted to do everything so i was nominated <laughs> this is something i didn't expect like this was me just telling god in my corner that okay god i want to have like this deep relationship with you i want to learn more about you and all of those things like that and god was just cooking something for me somewhere else the head of my unit in church was able to like nominate me for a leadership program i was so excited like when she told me i want to nominate you i was like yes 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 yes, yes. i'm going to do because i was I, if i was not nominated i couldn't be there because it was a paid course and we that we were nominated we were on scholarship so i was like yes 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 i'm so interested and then i did that and i completed that i completed it in may and my graduation um is coming up so I'm going to be, I'll show you guys a picture of my graduation. Yes, I'm going to show you guys. I'll post it after this, <laughs> after this video. So that is another amazing thing that honestly I am so proud of myself and I am so excited about and I'm really grateful to God. Yeah. So yes, let's now move to the good news. Oh. God has really been so faithful and very kind like to me. It's as if now if I just tell God I want this, you just give me bam, like just take. <laughs> I am so excited to share this news because you guys that are already like an OG on this channel, you can testify to the goodness of God about how I have suffered. <laughs> about how i have suffered about this particular news that i am about to share with you guys and yes ps this is already this is like two or one o'clock one a.m in the morning i am filming in the middle of the night because of noise i do not want outside noise to disturb my video so that's why i am filming by this time of the day so let's continue so are you ready are you ready for the good news are you ready? before i share the good news i would like to say something that and what i want to say is that if there's anything you are asking god for oh no let me say that if you want to ask god for something eh be very specific you are his child you are god's child like you are god you are literally god's child so go with that mindset see let me tell you something when you want to ask your parents for something we are always very specific like a child when you are still a child you will tell your mommy the color <laughs> and your dad you tell them the color of that shoe that you want like and you must get it if you don't get it, it's her problem and share it so i feel like we should be the same way with god like when you're asking for something don't just ask as far because you can't see god like because you cannot see him so you don't know how to ask 
let me teach you how to well, the next after you watch this video eh the next time you're going to ask something from god just use this method Tell him in details, like be very detailed about it. God, I want this thing to so, suit. So you might not be able to put time because you know. In fact, you can put time more. It depends. It depends on how your faith can carry it. Because when it comes to God, we are in a matter of faith with Him. Like it's the level of faith that you have. But if you know that your faith cannot carry time, be very specific about that particular blessing. How you want the blessing to be like? What you want to see? The signs you want to see, everything, just listen to him because he's going to answer. Yes, I'm a testifier. I'm a testimony to that. Like, I can testify to it that if you do this thing, like, you will literally see it manifest, honestly. So, hmm, are you ready for the news? Let's go on a commercial break. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I want to just do like one of those who wants to be a millionaire. <laughs> So I can keep you guys on suspense. Okay, so let me just share the news with you guys. You guys know how I have suffered. I have gone through it. I have been through hell and I've come back when it comes to phone. And honestly, one of the major reasons why I have not filmed anything so far is because I didn't have a phone and my iPhone X, I use my iPhone X to film, has really showed me shaky. Ha! Huh. If there's any if there's anything more than shaggy that phone has actually dealt with me and at a point in the year i was just like i'm not going to film anything again i'm tired this phone is not working and i'm not using it anymore i want a new phone and then i started telling god god i want a new phone and i was specific normally you know in nigeria now you accept if you don't chop belly food we say you get like you get you get you understand you have enough more than enough that's the only time you carry money and go and buy new iPhone, new one for Bali. You get a uh hair. -huh. So I knew that if I was going to get it myself, I would have to get UK used or used and all of those things. And I told God, I said, I don't want the used phone. I told God, maybe I will swap the iPhone X, then I used to collect 11 or something like that. I told God that I do not want a, I do not want a used phone. I want a new phone. Yes, yeah, so I'm telling people now, as I said, that when you want to go back to ask God for something, please be very specific. Yes, I'm giving that instruction. Be very, very specific about what you want. If it is Japa that you want, see, be specific about the country. Tell me when you want it to happen. See, let your faith be strong. <laughs> I don't know how to put it, but yeah, let your faith be very strong. Believe that I can do it because see anything you want from God in this life So far you are his child. He can do it for you. If he does not do it for you, it's either it is not time You may be your your capacity or something cannot carry what you want at that time And it's probably keeping you, it's protecting you from what you cannot manage But I know for sure that if God knows that you deserve that thing, he's going to give you it's even to the very least mundane things like things that do not that when you tell people people will be like is that what you're asking god for see ask him ask him i'm telling you to ask him now even if it is that god i want hair or god i want see it's the only sugar daddy that you can be in this life forget all this one you're on earth they go rubbish <laughs> God is the only sugar daddy that you can build like you will literally build him and he will deliver yes so I told God that I don't want a used phone. Mm -mm. I don't want a used phone. I want a brand new phone from Pali. The one that they open that I will see the Pali like this. <laughs> that I will see the Pali like this. I will see cha cha new one. <laughs> I told God that that's what I wanted. And I did not. I was not specific. I was. I'm currently using an. I, I was using an iPhone X. So I was not specific about the upgrade. Cause me, I don't really care. I don't care if twenty iPhone twenty is out. I don't really care about it. Cause it's none of my business. All I just want is a good phone with good camera and all of that. So I didn't give God any particular iPhone. I just said I want a new iPhone. That is all that I said. And January came, February came, March came, May came. So when it was in May, I think May or April or something. I, I just went into the DM of this particular person and I was like, ah, the person got 
somebody really close a phone and i was like ah you bought this person a person a phone oh that okay oh that please oh that's me call i just like jokingly told the person that what of my own or something like that and then this person was like if i get you a phone hope you manage it and i'm like this person is based in the us so number one i knew that she cannot buy me a used phone and i was like ma you say wait you, you manage did you did you just tell me to manage i don't understand what do you mean by manage <laughs> so i was like i'll manage it <laughs> i'll manage it ma why would i and she was like okay no problem i'm going to get you a phone and i was like wow now the second thought that was not come to my head was like ah, this person is until like she's a grown-up like she's like balagba she should not go and buy me iphone 7 plus now i mean she should not go and buy me iphone 8 or something that I, won't, I, I just told god that when anyone she buys for me i will appreciate it too that but i want the one that is higher than the one i am currently using that was all i just said to god and guys guys i want to cry i want to cry because ah god can be trusted and you can actually ask god for anything and he's going to do it for you yes this is not about phone but the phone is just the testimony but yeah all of this sudden she reached out after like um i think after when she got the phone she now reached out to me and she was like um i've gotten the phone and she sent me pictures it looked like i was dreaming because i was like is this how god works like just like that an iphone 12 new one brand new like new one from the pan brand new iphone 12 and i was like is this really like is this how god works like like this i was so like i was so shocked and i was really really happy because number one i couldn't have gotten the money myself because as you all know <laughs> i'm preparing for my wedding i'm never going to come through so i had to just lean on god's part just look up to god to help me because there was no way i was going to get the phone from absolutely nowhere and God already saw ahead of me. He, he already knew how much I was in dead need of a new phone. And he knew that I was coming here to come and preach, like, preach him to the entire world, <laughs> basically. Because I'm sure a lot of people are going to watch this video. Yes, I have a new phone now. <laughs> That's why I said that you guys are going to be like seeing my video now because I have no excuses anymore. Your girl now has a new phone yeah thank you thank you thank you for the congratulations i'm receiving this is my full chest because i even congratulate me those that have been on this channel would understand because my phone has really 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 dealt with me honestly so i'm here to publicly say god bless you ma for buying me this phone i know she won't watch it but i pray that god will god will replenish every pocket that this money came from in jesus mighty name and yes for those of you that have stayed with me up until this moment the family we have a new phone now i'm so grateful for this love i'm really 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 grateful like my heart is so filled with joy and i am thankful this time around i mean every word that you're going to be seeing every other video because we now have a phone so that's just basically it like that is the good news i mean, is it not good news <laughs> if it is not good news in your ear maybe i don't know rich kid you know you might be seen iphone 12 as old phone maybe you have used it you have dumped it ah rich kid rich kid i'm sorry me i'm not a rich kid by the grace of god we will get there but as of now i am so grateful like i am really really grateful honestly like i'm so thankful to god that I got this phone without spending a penny from my account like not even one naira from my account god is marvelous god can be trusted so um that is basically it about my life updates and you guys should just be ready to see videos back to back from me honestly back to back yes it's gonna be back to back after this video i'm most likely going to be posting my intro vlog because i have had my introduction wedding is coming <laughs> if you watch my intro vlog this is a very chaotic and funny video honestly you're going to see my mommy display in full drama we now have a better phone with more space and um, quality and um, camera and all of those things 
thank you so much guys for watching my video thank you for taking out time to stay to this moment like i said that this video was going to be full with so many stories i'm so glad that you guys get to listen to everything i had to say and if this is your very first time coming across my channel please don't forget to hit the subscribe button before you leave like don't just don't just look at my face and go and just go. see hey, you don't know what god will do maybe maybe your jackpot story self will come from my channel okay eh? or maybe one one thing that you believe god for is in my channel you come on <laughs> yeah so all this is just a joke but please i'm begging you guys eh? a joke a joke please subscribe to my channel i'm begging i'm begging please subscribe to my channel actually just get me to 200 thank you so much for watching this video and my other videos i hope to see you guys in my next video bye guys Was it filming? Ha! Ah, what if it's not filming? It's not possible. We have a new phone. Duh.